While a foremost anti-corruption group, the Network Against Corruption and Trafficking has called on the EFCC and the ICPC to probe the outgoing governor of River, across River State, Ben Ayade, over 500 billion naira embezzlement of the state's fund. The group spokesperson Itaye Ekbobobe alleged that the Cross River State government governor squandered the state resources through spurious contracts awarded to his family members and cronies through withdrawals from various bank accounts. The coalition of civil societies led by Network Against Corruption and Trafficking NACAT embarked on a comprehensive audit of the Cross River State government account between 2015 and 2020. The NACAT, through this comprehensive audit, discovered financial infractions and irregularities ranging from circumvention of procurement processes, suspicious payment of monies, possible money laundry, to award of contracts to non-existing shell companies. These financial manipulations have cost the good people of Cross River State money amounting to over 500 billion naira under the watch of Professor Ben Ayade. That these eight years of Ayade's rule has set back the development of the state by 20 years. It is on this note that we are calling on the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, to be on alert to quickly invite him to give clarification on these blatant irregularities bordering on wanton looting of the Cross River State Treasury to the tune of over 500 billion naira. They further gave a breakdown of the illicit transactions perpetrated through fictitious company names and with the aid of his chief of staff, Martins Oren, promising to take copies of the petition written by the group to the EFCC and the ICPC, as well as the embassies of the USA and the UK and Canada. 3rd of August, 278 million by the chief of staff government as Martin Sorin. There seems to be a lot of uh, activities that are quite uh, in, uh, against the law committed by this office of uh, the chief of staff to the governor. And we do know that this is directly under the behest of the governor himself. So for 2018, a plethora of withdrawals and transfers running into billions were made between the government and persons in government, and as, as well as go, uh, companies with affiliations to persons in government. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.